Hey guys, welcome back to another reaction, and today I'm here with a certain scientific railgun episode 20, and um, I'm trying, I'm gonna try to um, do the last four episodes, like um, uh, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, um, cause if someone else uploads something, usually I would just do that since it's shorter, right? Just a shorter reaction since it is on the weekend, um, cause sometimes I do stuff um during the weekend so i won't have enough time for like an episode right um but most of the time i would but sometimes i just be going out somewhere so yeah but um i'm gonna try and do the rest of the four episodes right and if someone else um you know upload something and i um want to react to it i'll probably just do a double upload that day or just basically um skip it and then just wait later on right but uh, basically, I want like the most episodes like of um, index in a week, right? So I don't have to watch like um, one or two episodes and I have to wait like um, three days just to watch um, some more, right? Because you know, Seven Deadly Sins is gonna come out tomorrow. Then you got Doctor Stone after that, and then Jujutsu Kaisen. So yeah, I um, wouldn't feel like uh, doing a double episode upload um, those days. And plus, I want to just get those out as early as I can. So, yeah. But, um, I hope you guys will enjoy this. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe. And, yeah, let's get this reaction started. Okay, yep, that earthquake. I was gonna say, where are we in the city? But um, yeah, there it goes. That earthquake. Uh, I don't know about those dogs, but okay. But yo, nah, bro. Nah, that. Whoa, what? Hold up. There's someone up in there or something like. Yo, but yeah, that that earthquake. Nah, there's something to do with that. Nah, I know there's someone's doing that. <laughs> I know they are. Oh no, <laughs> they wailing with these dolls, bro. Oh no. I was about to say, did it transition to the opening like that, like uh, go up in the sky? But um, nah, bro. Those those earthquakes. Someone someone's doing that. Nah. Okay, so a new transfer student, okay. And, <laughs> yo, we just gonna not accept the fact that, okay, the opening, yeah, good. <laughs> I can talk, but, um, uh, yo, we, we not gonna accept the fact that, um, there's some dolls, like, nah, bro, some dolls just going at it like that, nah. <laughs> I don't know about that. Someone was definitely up in there. Or levitating something or doing whatever i don't know oh yeah i forgot about that she can just teleport them all in there yep bro nah i know when they're foreshadowing something like i knew it but yeah they're gonna be having some meeting with um anti-skill what well, with judgment and anti-skill about the earthquakes but nah like the level upper I mean, I didn't know because they didn't introduce it until, like, episode, like, um, six or seven, but they were kind of, like, foreshadowing something with that, right? Like, with the, um, who was it? The one guy with, like, the, uh, pyrokinesis or, like, basically from the first episode of the anime, right? Um, like, how he had, like, some really, um, strong power or something like that, and then the other girl who could turn invisible, right? It was kind of foreshadowing it, but at the same time, I wouldn't have known because I didn't know anything about the level upper by then. Yo, wait, hold up. I never realized how many people there actually are in um, Judgment and Anti-Skill. Poltergeist? Yo, so I guess that would explain those um dolls just moving on their own then. But yeah, I... <laughs> I never realized the fact how many there actually were. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> hold up. 
that was a lot of information. Let me say that again. Uh, RSPK. Okay, it's a condition. Oh, an Esper loses control over this their cells, causing a subconscious, uncontrollable burst outburst of power. Okay. Yo. Okay, I see. So the poltergeist phenomenon when occurring on a larger scale may manifest as an earthquake like. So basically, someone loses the control over themselves and then basically that un uncontrollable power is calling uh, causing the um earthquakes or earthquake like um like effect. Sign. I don't think I don't think they're listening to you. B Sucker was clearly right there in the background, um, handing her that ice cream or whatever that is. Um, I forgot the name of those things. Yeah, I, I think they are realizing something that I realized too. Like, hold up, does she? It seemed like she didn't um have a normal childhood. I don't know. I mean, she didn't even know anything about whack-a-mole. Imagine not knowing about that. <laughs> uh, it seems like she's never been to an arcade before. Like, she only went to school and that was it. You know, I really wanted to laugh at her just getting hit by the, um, the, um, window right there. But <laughs> I was like... <laughs> She just probably didn't notice, but still, <laughs> yo, like, just walk, sh just face first into, like, a window like that, like, yo, she was, I mean, not weird, but, uh, I would say, um, very different, you know, uh, unique, yeah, I'll put it like that, she's very unique. It seems like they're having some trouble <laughs> putting that on. Uh, what were they called? The, um, Yukatas? I think that's what they were called, Yukatas. Like, the, the stuff that they, um, wear when they go to fireworks. Yeah, yeah, they're, they're Yukata, well, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but it was like, um, uh, Y-U-K-A, um, T-A. Yeah, yeah, Yukata, I think. <laughs> it, it was something with the Y. Yo, yo, <laughs> okay, I was about to say, <laughs> like, are they just pretending to do work, and then, like, once he closes the door, that's when they, um, hurry up and sneak out or something? Oh, yeah, well, what happened to, uh, Congo? That was a, um, prime suspect to that, um, poltergeist, right? Uh, what happened to her? <laughs> what happened to her, and I'm... <laughs> I'm laughing because I just realized Congo is always the one who's experiencing this type of stuff, right? Especially um the incident with the eyebrows and then like big spider. <laughs> Yo, like she's always um basically the one who um has a problem first or gets like um involved with it first. Yeah, it would be a real coincidence if an earthquake happened right now. If y'all know what I mean, a real coincidence, you know? Ah, uh, yeah, the most crucial moment when it's happened. Yeah, during the fireworks, yeah, watch how an earthquake happen. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> it's, it's just that I know it's gonna happen. Well, I don't even know it. I'm just thinking like that, <laughs> but still... Wait a second. When I saw that, I was like, hold up. Because, wait, wasn't wasn't the AIM... I know it had to deal with, like, that um one lady who made the level upper, but... um I, Was it the AIM diffusion field? I, I forgot. Was that, like, a bad thing or, like, a good thing? I remember that from back back then, though, from, like, episode 14 or something, though. So, or, like, 15. Oh, 
wait a second. What did Kirkle just say? Hold up, bro. She said, let's imitate the fireworks and let our buddies glow, bro. Okay. Kirkle, she got the most wildest imagination. Yo. She, she's the cause of it. Yo. She's probably the cause of it. That um transfer student, what was it, a uh, Harune? I think it's her. Because she been acting kind of weird. I don't know. Like, she wasn't her normal self or something. Yeah, spe especially once she left or just went on on her own. Like... I was about to say, don't end it on me when the light post was uh, falling on them. Like, she did something. She had to have. I know Uriah was fine, bro. I, it's just, yo, her. Her name, wait. Oh. I was thinking her name did something, but, um. Yeah, it was, um, anti-skill, wasn't it? Yo, they really out here with some with some robots, bro, that they can control. Okay. Yo. I thought they just had those regular, like, mini security robots. I didn't know they actually had, like, um, actual suits that they could get inside of. Like, but, yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure either the main cause or part of the cause is, um, this Harune girl right here, though. Oh, I was about to say, wait, what does that mean? <laughs> I saw TBC. I was like, oh, okay, to be continued. Um, I had to think real quick for a second there. Um, but yeah, finally getting to some uh, plot. <laughs> now let me stop. Um, no, I'm not saying that the uh, last few episodes were um, bad or anything. I'm not even saying that. Those, those last few episodes, even if it was, um, I mean, I wouldn't say random episode. It's just... Um, that one guy who commented and said it's a bunch of random episodes. Um, I'm going to just go off of that. But yeah, even though it was a bunch of random episodes, they were pretty good. I mean, it's not like um, I'm really expecting any plot from this, like, <laughs> too much like that. Because, I mean, it was a side story from what they said in the beginning on the first episode to Index. And plus, I mean, um... I really don't mind if they're just sitting here just having fun all day. Like, uh, it's just this anime. I just enjoy it, right? I mean, just a whole different atmosphere from um, Index, right? Just, um, you know, you got different people and then you don't always um, have, I guess, like, um, I guess you could say um, the main character um, I don't know, um, cause there's more than one main character, I know, I know that, like, instead of having Toma, like, um, I guess, uh, win the battle or something like that, or at least think of a plan to, uh, win or something like that, or fix something, right, um, instead of that, you just got them, like, going to firework festivals and stuff, like, even though there is these, uh, diffusion or not diffusion field but um earthquakes going on and all that it's not like um i guess you could say misaka is the only one who won right because she is the strongest out of all of them it's actually everybody working together right to um i guess you could say fix the problem or something like that and um sometimes you actually got other characters that they develop the story on even if it's just one episode they at least show a little bit of them right so that's what i basically mean by like different atmosphere like um it's not like index doesn't develop on their characters they do also um it's just th this does it more because it's not always constantly um i guess you could say stuff going on right because they did have big spider i really wouldn't call that like an um major issue for them right i'll just say like that was just a little um thing to show us like i guess you could say connery and her backstory right and um also like someone who basically 
she liked and well i'm pretty sure she did but like liked and um i guess you could say cared cared for and all that like basically respect it yeah um what was his name um dang i forgot it it was um dang i forgot what his name was but i think yeah charisma charisma she um basically had the respect for him and all that basically just backstory and all that like it's not always a problem going on like this right right now but yeah that's about it though for this episode i hope you guys did enjoy this so uh, make sure you like and subscribe again and yeah make sure make sure it right now yeah leave a like and subscribe again and i'll see you guys in the next one bye